Hey YouTube, this is Blueberry7497 here, and I'm back with another video. Uh, in this video, I'm just going to be taking a uh, going to be taking you through the um, installation process of iOS 6 for the iPod Touch fourth generation. Um, so as you can see, here's my iPod Touch, and as we click uh, software update, you can see iOS 6, and it says this update contains over 200 new features, including all new Apple Design Maps, Siri features, Facebook integrations, shared photo streams, Passbook, and more. So we'll go ahead and hit download and install and agree to these terms and services. Uh, connect it to a power source um, and to find them just about full. So I'll let that, it says about eight minutes. And uh, I know that I, I don't have it on my little stand so it's kind of rocky but my uh, my router is right out here so that's, that's the reason why um, why I came out here to do this. Okay, here we go. So, software update. iOS 6 will be installed in 5 seconds. Your iPod will restart. An installation will uh, is uh, when it is finished. So go and hit install now and agree. It's in here, and it'll verify the update with Apple. Verifying and there we go. It's starting the installation process now um, This will probably take uh, some time so I will either just go ahead and cut it or uh, fast forward depending on how long it takes uh, I just want to make a quick note that the whole download and preparation process took about 45 minutes or so um, with the relatively fast uh, internet connection uh, No one else was on the internet for uh, anything um, just this iPod uh, which was downloading iOS 6 so, here it is going through the installation process now. Okay, so we're back with the uh, installation process, and it has just finished up, and now it's rebooting. I'd like to point out that the uh, the entire download to installation to get to this process took uh, about an hour, um, probably a little bit more than an hour, I'd say. Um, so right here, I'm not sure what this uh, loading bar is for, but uh, I hope it goes uh, fast because it, it did just un uh, I mean install the iOS 6. Okay, so it just finished, and we're back at the uh, Apple logo. And you see how uh, it just did its uh, initial boot. Uh, now we have iOS 6 right here on the screen. Update completed. Continue. I'll just get out of the way just in case any sensitive information. Yeah. So it's just having me sign in with my uh, Apple ID. You can skip the step, um, or you can choose not to. Um, now it says updating iCloud settings, just like that. So I'll go ahead and take it away just in case more information pops up. But that's how the screen uh, is looking right now still. seems to be taking quite a while, a few minutes. Okay, there we go. Um, so, uh, what it's doing now is it's giving me um, my messaging options of uh, where people can meet you, uh, can uh, contact you via iMessage or FaceTime, or and or FaceTime. So it's giving me a list of email addresses as well as uh, address, um, 
as well as phone numbers. But since I'm on an iPod Touch, I am only going to be able to uh, have people reach me at an email address. Um, so let's we'll hit next. So if you have multiple emails associated with your account, it's going to go ahead and list all those emails for you for people to be able to reach you at uh, through iMessage and or FaceTime. So start using iPod Touch. And here we go. Here's um, the new iOS 6. Here's the new settings. Um, I'll just give you a quick rundown. I know that this video uh, is going to be kind of long. Um, so if we go to general and software update, I'll just go ahead and show you. It's checking. And you can see the blue the blue hue up here. Um, I know it's kind of hard to see, but uh, it's, it's blue. Um, it says checking for update. Okay, that's taking too long. I'll just go ahead and go into the about for you and scroll and you'll see version 6.0. I know it's kind of hard to see, um, but it says 6.0. Um, so with iOS 6, it comes with uh, a ton of new features, most of which it says 200. Um, I believe they, they use that same number for iOS 5. So I'm sure there are somewhere in the OS 200 new features um, or around that many, but the most apparent ones are the ones that I'll be covering in, a, in, a, in an upcoming video. So stay tuned for that. And I hope you like this video. Go ahead and uh, give it a like up if you did. Subscribe up there for more coverage on iOS 6. And uh, leave a comment down below if there's something specific you want to see in iOS 6 or you just feel like uh, leaving a comment. I'll catch you in the next video.